Welcome to the rocket profile of the Vector R, Vector Launch Incorporated's attempt to make the smallest orbital rocket in the world. Vector R has a launch pad mass of just 5 tons and aims to carry 61 kilograms to low Earth orbit from Wallops Flight Facility in Virginia and 26 kilograms to sun synchronous orbit from the Pacific Spaceport Complex in Kodiak, Alaska. The Vector R is unique not only in its size, but also its propellant. It uses propylene fuel with liquid oxygen oxidizer. Propylene is C3H6 and has performance comparable to methane CH4, but has a higher boiling point, 225 Kelvin, compared to 111 Kelvin for methane. It is also more dense than methane, meaning it is a good substitute for kerosene. The first stage of Vector R is 1.2 meters in diameter and has three LP1 engines, each producing around 27 kilonewtons in vacuum for 2 minutes and 23 seconds. Its specific impulse is not posted, but with a typical chamber pressure and typical efficiencies for a new engine, it probably gets around 313 seconds specific impulse in vacuum and at least 295 seconds, though that with extremely lightweight tanks. Otherwise, it's not going to be able to carry the kind of payload that they are aiming to carry with the Vector R. The second stage is a 4.4 kN thrust LP2 engine burning for 7 minutes and 13 seconds. Its specific impulse is around 350 seconds and at least 330 seconds. With an upgraded engine, perhaps with a higher chamber pressure, much higher specific impulse is possible with this fuel and oxidizer combination but the engines on Vector R may be limited because they are pressure-fed rather than turbo-pump-fed. On the bright side, the comparative simplicity of the engines should make them easier to produce. Vector R completed two suborbital tests last year that were both considered successful. It has another suborbital test in the works and then a sun-synchronous orbit commercial launch planned from Kodiak, Alaska, followed by a regular low-Earth orbit launch. As with Rocket Lab and their 10-ton Electron rocket, Vector Launch expects that their $3 million price point will lead to around 100 customers a year. Will this expected era of frequent small orbital rocket flights pan out? Hopefully we'll find out soon. Until then, we can at least look forward to the first orbital flight of the Vector R and its distinctive three-in-a-row first stage arrangement reminiscent of the original Atlas rockets. In pioneering a new space fuel, there may be applications of Vector's engine technology beyond the Vector R itself. Thank you for watching this rocket profile of the Vector R.